Katie, if you're going this weekend, you might see them, but it will <laughs> yeah, be chilly it at the will beach be. and everywhere else. Yeah, you know what, though? Some people live for the off season. My in laws absolutely love Cape May any other time than the summer. Yeah. So, it's, <laughs> yeah, I think a lot of people really love going down there. So, why not? You've actually got a really nice weekend for it. But you're right, Rahel, it's going to be very chilly outside, which we'll get to. And I want to point your uh, focus here also to a storm system that's developing currently in the midsection of the U.S. This is going to make its, uh, its travels east and bypass us, thankfully, off to the south into tomorrow. But that's the reason that we'll see a few more clouds tomorrow and maybe even a stray shower very far south. Heck, Cape May could even see a few sprinkles. But all in all, it's a nice weekend for for most of us, but you've heard the rumor of this next nor'easter. Let's talk about what we're currently facing with this. We're going to compare two separate models here. We've got the GFS and the European model, two of the major ones that uh, we tend to use for our guidance. So the GF mod, uh, GFS model takes this uh, track pretty s far south and then eventually up the coastline. So this would mainly, according to the GFS, be a rain event with a possible uh, accumulating snow on the back edge of it. Now the European model, well, that's a little different. That one keeps the track a little closer to the coast, a colder, slower solution, ergo a much better potential for snow here in our area. Again, potential is a word that we want to continue to use until there's certainty, and there just isn't because it's so far out. This is next Tuesday through Thursday, guys, so just stick with us on this. I am a big fan, though, since we're sensitive to the word Nor'easter at this point, of giving you a nice big heads up about what will eventually happen, even though there are still questions. Now, off in the distance here uh, from Place One Apartments, this is Plymouth Meeting. You can see the radio towers with no problem. We have a nice, clear sky out there to kick things off, and happy St. Patrick's Day to you. I can't do an Irish accent, otherwise I'd try. Stray shout is off to our south, but most of us are just going to see some clouds. Now, looking forward here in the seven day, Misha, there's not one day that's even seasonable. And yes, as we mentioned, even in time to kick off spring, nor'easter number four.